Hey everybody, today's video is different than any other video I've done. Today I'm on a quest for penny squishers. I love penny squishers. I collect them everywhere I go. No matter where I've gone in the world, I always try to get a penny squisher. Now today I'm going to head down to downtown Disney, which nothing's really open. Uh, there's no food, drink, or anything, but the stores are open. And a lot of the stuff's over where they have penny squishers. So I'm going to go down there and get some penny squishers. I'm all set. I got a stack full of quarters. I got a stack full of really shiny pennies. You can see how shiny. Ooh, look at that. How shiny that is. So I'm going to take my. I gotta, this is how crazy I am. I even have a special bag. So I'm going to take my quarters and just load them up in there. Like that. And then I got. My, like I said, my shiny, shiny pennies. These are, these are like, like, look at that. Ooh, jeez. Oh, drop them. Can't lose them. That's one less penny squisher I get. So I'm going to go down there and try to get me some penny squishers. Now we're all set and we're ready to go. All right, here we go. This is going to be a nice little drive. It's about an hour and a half for me. We're gonna have a lot of fun getting us some penny squishers. And just as a little luck charm, so we get some cool penny squishers, we got a pair of chance cubes hanging from the rear view mirror. That's right, some Han Solo dice. Bring us luck, bring us luck, bring us luck, bring us luck, yeah. So I'm here at Downtown Disney, looking for penny squishers. We're gonna get some, I guarantee, we're gonna get some Donald ones, because that's what I get. Donald stuff. All right, let's go. And here we are. The absolute closest I can get to Disneyland. No penny squishers today from there. Very sad. I decided to start at this end of the resort uh, so I could um, work my way back. I like California Adventure. I like the way they've changed the front of it to look like uh, Disney Studios in Hollywood. It looks pretty cool. Now, no tickets required. We just walk right in this entrance. This fountain's so cool. South East Central. I love this place. So cool. Alright, let's go find some penny squishers. Mickey, how's it going? I know it's such a beautiful day. All right, we're gonna turn our penny into a collectible. I don't get every penny I see, but I cannot pass up a Hank penny. Here we get a Hank here. Find door on the back. All right, this is one of those rare machines where I actually I'm gonna get all three: a little color, a little mermaid, and Midway Media. All right. Number Yeah, 
three of them there. And if they blend a Vista Street on the back, then they got the, the press on the front. Cool. Yeah, we did find another machine where I'm going to get all three. We got the red car trolley, Steamboat Willie painting Buena Vista Street, and the California Venture logo. Let's get to it. Okay, now I know I said I don't get every penny squisher, but how can you pass up the Holy Trinity? We got Mickey, Goofy, and Donald. So, I might even have this Donald already, but that's fine. I never have too many Donald things, as if anybody's seen my collection knows. We'll start with Mickey. A goofy drops them right in there, and then as much as I collect these things, I never know which way to turn the penny, which side's better. But I kind of put it with the head facing the side I think it's going to be pressed on. Do that, and my favorite, Donald. And there he goes. Right there. And there we go. The Holy Trinity of Disney characters, Mickey, Goofy, and Donald. Cool. Penny Swisher, right? Sometimes I think this is a penny squisher, but it's where they make dog tags. But here's the penny squisher. And this one's a little different, because it's got a crank, and you have to actually line up what you want. So we're gonna get this one here. We're gonna get Tinkerbell. That's my wife's favorite. So we're gonna get that. Putting the quarters in the penny section. There we go. We're gonna drop that in there. Then the penny drops, and then we gotta get to where we want. Oh, I messed up. So the first time we messed up, didn't listen to my own advice, or my, yeah, so we put that in there. Before we push it in, we got to line this up to what we want. Now we want Tinkerbell. So we line her up there, then we push in the coin, and then we turn it. And there she is. We got pink. No design on the back of this one. These are an older kind of machine, but there she is. So this one's located in the back, kind of out of the way over by the bathrooms. You gotta kind of look for it, but sometimes if you go to like guest services and ask them, they'll give you a map or a list of where all the penny squishers are. All right, and here is probably our last penny squisher of the day. You see this here. We got Lightning McQueen, Minnie, Pirate Mickey. I think you know which one we're going for. Let's get that in there. My hands will work. And let's not make the same mistake. Let's line that up. Here's what we want. So. Okay. 
There we go. Hit it. And spin it. And there we go. Got ourselves a nice, cool Donald Swisher. Which I'm pretty sure I have this one already, but like I said, you can never have too much Donald stuff. That was pretty successful. Now, if anybody knows me, knows I could not leave downtown Disney without visiting your old sandwich. Give me a sandwich. Of course, you can't eat it here. You gotta get it to go. So I'm gonna go in here, I'm gonna pick it up, get out to the car, and drive home eating a Nerdle sandwich. All right, I got my Earl of Sandwich and a nice cold beverage. I'm gonna drive home and check out all of our penny squishers. Here we go. We got the we got the coins here, the pressed pennies. Let's check it out. Let's separate them here. I should have about I think uh, I think I got like 17 of them. So yeah, I think we got some pretty good ones here. We got the um, the one with Walt and Mickey. I forget the, the name of the statue, but um, you can um, see that there. I think I even got some video of that. You'll see the statue in the video. But um, that's pretty cool. It's And it's got um, on the back, it has uh, California Adventure Buena Vista Street. So that's on the back of it right there. But... Um, this with this statue, it's different from. Now I know partners, partners were they're pointing out to the to the horizon, but this one is supposed to be Walt as he just got off of the train in Hollywood, with his eyes wide open, ready to to um, take on the world. And so that one, that one's that one's pretty cool, and you can tell the differences in some of them. Like uh, this one was the an older machine, so it's. And I think this is the hand crank one. It, it, see how it's a more oval. This one's more stretched out. I think it might have something to do with because they're pressing it to get the front end back. And the newer machines just kind of really, I mean, really take that. Look, you can see the size difference. See that? This one was the uh, Pirate Pirates of the uh, Caribbean Mickey that I got an accident because <laughs> I was trying to get the Tinkerbell and I... And I for my wife and I didn't uh, set the arrow the right way, but it's still a, a cool uh, penny squisher um, or pressed penny if you want to call it. But um, yeah, so we got the Walt and Mickey there. We got the um, Pirates of the Caribbean Mickey there. I think this was one of the first ones I got. As I said, I like to go. I walk all the way down to the end, uh, Buena Vista Street, and then made my way back uh, so I can kind of see where they are. And I, I know I won't miss one instead of just going searching. This one was Hank from Finding Dory. Now that one, uh, I don't like it. And it says, uh, it has the Finding Dory logo on the back. Now I don't, like I said, I don't usually get every one of them. But um, in that movie, Finding Dory, I loved the Hank character. The Septopus, because he, he didn't have uh, eight legs. He only had seven, because I guess one got cut off or something. I forget. But And I think Ed O'Neill did a great job. Um, portraying that character. But anyway, so we got Hank right there from Finding Dory. This one was the red uh, red trolley, the, the um, red trolley car that they added, that they added when they remade uh, the opening of California Adventure into Buena Vista Street and made it more like old Hollywood. They added the red car trolley. So that's the red car trolley there. That one was pretty cool. Then, of course, they got Carthay Circle. They did that one in a coin and it's like I said I like to use the shiny coins look at that uh, it's so shiny I like them when they're nice and shiny like that I mean I'll take whatever I can get when I get coins pressed sometimes but um, if I if I know ahead of time I like to get the um, the shiny ones you go to your go to your local bank and ask them you know see if they have any new pennies and um, sometimes they'll see if they have like a, a fresh uh, sealed roll. That's what this was. It was, you can see the shiny on each, and so you know they're brand new. Uh, this one was uh, Steamboat Willie 
with a paintbrush. There you go. And uh, that one is uh, him uh, painting, uh, like on Buena Vista Street said there, which is kind of funny to see Steamboat Willie with a paintbrush because he was black and white. <laughs> Maybe it's supposed to symbolize him moving from the black and white to the uh, color cartoons. There, and then we got the uh, California Adventure logo, which uh, with the Bene Buena Vista um, Street on the back. That's the California Adventure logo, which, like I said, I believe I have a California Adventure logo, uh, Pace Fisher, but I don't have it with the uh, Buena Vista Street logo on the back. So that's that's kind of cool. Uh, this one we got here, if I can even see this. Oh, this is a Midway Mania. I just got that because I'd never seen that one before. Let's see here. We got uh, my my second favorite Disney character, Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. I love Oswald. I've always loved Oswald. Um, I've always been one of those people who talks about how um, he's the original Mickey Mouse. If it didn't get uh, if he didn't get stolen from Walt, then Ub Iwerks doesn't create Mickey Mouse. And we have Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. And let's see here we got we got the uh, we got our the Donald Duck uh, Pirates of the Caribbean one now this is probably like the third or fourth time I've got this one I just always I don't know why I see it I have to get it um, I just love Donald and then uh, the last one well, not the last one but this one we have here this is um, um, Mickey and Minnie there like that you see that okay. I know they're hard to see. I don't even know if they'll come across, but it's Mickey and Minnie there. And this is an older one. Um, is uh, It says uh, on the back, Hollywood. It almost says like Hollywood Land or something like that. So it's one of the older It's one of the older ones. I don't know if it's old because it's got the Cartier Circle there, but it says Hollywood Land on it. So that's pretty cool. Can't go wrong with Mickey and Minnie. And these are some of the newer ones. This is the newer ones I got. Um... I got these at the World of Disney, the store, and you can tell these ones are squished really long, really long, and um, I couldn't pass up this because this was all three of the main, uh, you know, uh, Disney icons. It's Goofy, Mickey, and Donald, but they're it's they're pressed so hard that the, the penny squished out so flat. Like here's here's Goofy, and there's it's just almost like I don't know, like they're, like it almost kind of cut off the Disneyland on, on the Goofy. It, it just gets, it, it, it squishes so hard and I don't think it fills the whole thing. The World of Disney on the back is, is fine, but the art, it should always be that the art should be, give a little border around the, um, the penny. This one didn't, so that's uh, Goofy there. And then we got... Mickey here. I hope you can see him, um, because you can see his ear. Even his his ear gets cut off. Which if that's the way it's meant to be, that's the way it's meant to be. But I, I don't really care for that. I don't like that. Now Donald, he he made it all on there. Um, obviously his, the rest of his body's not going to be on there. But uh, still, I think these ones are a little too pressed or squished. If, if that's even possible. But, um, yeah, so, so we got like 17. We should, we've only had, we would have only had 16, but I made the mistake, you know, getting the, um, the Mickey, the Mickey one, um, there. But, yeah, and I still got like some more ready to go. So, yeah, I think they're pretty cool. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, yeah. And I would have gotten more if Disneyland was open, but Disneyland, not open. We can't even eat. I mean, there's restaurants open in Walt Disney World. You can go in and eat. Not even restaurants here. But you can get certain restaurants food to go. So I got Mia. Sandwich from Earl of Sandwich. This one, it'll say on there, today's special. Because this one is actually the holiday sandwich. Holiday sandwich is 
uh, mayonnaise, turkey, um, uh, stuffing, cranberries, and, and gravy. So it's a, basically it's a turkey Thanksgiving sandwich. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share this with all your friends. We're trying to build an audience here. And um, if you're watching this after we build the audience, hey, thanks. Thanks for helping us build the audience. Now you make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, okay? I'm going to enjoy my um, Earl of Sandwich and a nice uh, diet uh, cream soda. Oh, I love them. I love cream soda. Oh, and of course, got to have the, the Donald cup. I have like a Donald glass. This was for the 25th anniversary of Walt Disney World. And I now they're, now they're um, what, at 50. 50? Wow. So it's been 25 years since I've had this glass. And I really feel old. I mean, I, I don't really ever usually feel old. I mean, in my mind, I tell myself I'm, my mind tells me I'm 22. I always feel like I'm like 22, 23 years old. But then my knees tell me, no, you're not. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, have fun, and I'll see you soon.